Wait, do I not have the... Oh, here we go. You guys are here. You're invited. So she... Hello, Leslie. How's it going? No, us. No. Hi. Hello, everybody. How is the fam? The yam fam. That's actually... So that's someone else's deal. I don't want to copy that. Um, hello, everybody. Uh, staying up for this. Good. It is not one to be missed. I am excited to see what conspiracies we will talk about tonight. It is. Oh, wow. Didn't know that the uh, light here actually makes a difference. Bam. Add this. Paste that. All right. And then this is the form to submit your conspired theories, your conspiracy theories. I have a few of my own. I am, I am, I am a fan of uh, some hidden truths, some, some truths the world's just not ready for. I am. I should have said conspiracy. Let me let me redo that. Submit your cons theory. Your conspiracy theory. I can't, I can't, um, get it spelled right for the life of me. Oh, I gotta go later. You got school tomorrow? Valid. Today's your birthday, sad girl. Congratulations. Another year older and wiser. Happy birthday to you. You didn't try to crochet a cookie and the tutorial is hard. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I know you got the skills, Oshi. You got the skill. I'm gonna click that heart as well. God forbid. It just... Every single time. No, there we go. There we go. Replace pin message. Finally. How is everyone doing tonight? I, I hope you're all doing good. I, I am doing well. I want you guys to share in, in how well everyone is doing. How's your day so far? My ears are stopped up. My head feels like it's full of... I don't know what. Hold, hold on. Bum, bum, bum. Boop, 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 boop. Ah, um, 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 um. <laughs> my head feels whole. Oh, I got bullied today at school. It's Nova. Keep talking to your teachers. Keep talking to your principal. And I'm sure that they'll help uh, get that cleared up. Are you a Sigma Alpha Giga Chad? No, I am just a Sigma male out here on my Sigma grind set. You know, hitting up all my uh, gig jobs and doing. My Sigma male things, conspiracy form, but I am the person. Hold on. Forms.gugu.com. Take me to the conspiracies. Yeah, 1919 responses. So, okay, someone that wrote, I don't know, for real. For real, though. <laughs> Individual. Ah. <sighs> I have been once they shoved me into the locker and I got in trouble for it once again. You got in trouble. F so they, how, how big? Okay, first of all, Nova, like y'all needed some smaller lockers. Okay, like I don't know the last time I've seen a full sized locker, like it's in stacked two to a row. And if you're getting like shoved into like the really small ones, then we need to start talking about, um, I don't know, like some, some physics there. But assuming everything else being equal, um, man, I'd, I would, I would, uh, I'd find a buddy to walk with. So the lockers are five, two and you're four, 10. Yeah. You need, you need yourself a buddy for the hallway. Never expected to collab with nighttime audios. You know, nighttime audios actually reached out to me, uh, if you can believe it and you should, because it's the truth. I, uh, had this idea for a fresh and fit, uh, podcast, like kind of, poking fun of it, fun at it kind of deal. And uh, then he had slid into my DMs and said, hey man, when are, we gonna, when are we gonna collab? And I said, right now, my guy, right now, I am ready to collab. I am down to be crazy. 
Ah, oh, you're doing you're doing good, sad girl. That's great to hear. Sassy Susie. The Sassy Su Wait, it's Dustin's. Wait, I got, I got this. I recognize that bicep anywhere. You. <laughs> I need to have a select when I'm looking over here. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm looking over here at chat. That That's cool. That's cool. PFV keeps scaring you. It's just a bicep. It's a guy standing sideways. I texted my crush about it, and he said, quote, Oh, I'm sorry that's happening. That's so dumb. Want me to walk with you? Yes. Yes, exactly. You get yourself a hallway buddy. There you go. I'm her. What's up? Nothing much. Just you know, trying to get over a little bit of uh, what's probably like a cold or maybe allergies. Oh, 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 thank you very much for reminding me. I need to start up the bot. Pineapple head, how are you doing? Share, copy, YouTube. Connect to YouTube. Turn on a point system. Boom, now it should be working. There's a flu going around. If that's what it is, that explains a lot because I have had next to nothing working. Yes, I am a sigma. Let's see here. Is that volume a little bit a little bit down? A little bit too far down? Audio. Let's put you right up there. And then save settings pog online poggers all right double check the audio all the way up to the top boom and save i have a question do i believe that it's normally wrong to still hang out with someone when it's sometimes feel awkward to talk with them now it really depends on what made it feel awkward like if it's um i don't know like they told like a super racist joke you're like oh like, mm, that's super cringe, like that kind of stuff, like that, that might be a little bit too much awkward. But, um, read it, read it, should read all, triggered by chat commands, right? Yeah, should just be only working with chat commands. But overall, like, if it's just like, they're kind of awkward, I'd yeah, say go for it. Daisy, welcome to the stream. I don't know. It's, oh, wait, wait, school sucks and it almost got jumped and they told you to deal with it. Uh, let me also recommend to you a hallway buddy. Shouldn't walk alone. Yeah, okay, so Pineapple Head was using the say. I'm doing okay. Say, <laughs> woo. Let me turn off the desktop volume. There we go. All right. Oh God, I'm I'm late. No, you're not late. I I think I actually started a little late myself. Um, I I had to get the programs and everything opened up, but I do have the conspiracy theory form in front of me, and it has 19 red hot theories. Your eyes got red, Sophie. I hope they'll get better. Um, I changed the setting on your phone to like that nighttime setting, so it's like less 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 harsh light, and that'll probably help out. Uh, this said person is your best friend, but he used to have a girlfriend and I stopped talking to them when he did. I have to set boundaries for myself when that happens. Exactly. I mean, OMG, why must you read my errors? <laughs> oh no. You know, Sage was trying to teach me on God, like the, oh, on, on G, on G is like on God. That's, that's what I thought you meant. Uh, I didn't even know there was going to be a stream today. I'm just about to go sleep. It's okay, Leslie. I got it because I'm going to be on top of chat all day long. It is it is, you and me chat. It is just us. There is no games, no videos, no nothing. We are coming up with a um, rating system for these. Uh, when I say coming up with, I already have one established. I, I came up with it earlier today. But it's going to be a rating system for these conspiracy theories. They fall into four categories. Let me create the categories right now. Uh, come on. Text source application, audio browser, image scene, text. This is ratings. All right, and select font. Let's let's get something. Oh, that looks weird. All right, so these ratings come in uh, several sizes. So we got we got things that are real, 
things that are uh the next after real i have keebler elf all right so keebler elf is uh when i'm assigning things that are like they're maybe like not quite real but also at the same time you know it's it's pretty hard to believe that they're not real so in in this case okay yeah that's good um like okay okay keebler elves you can tell me keebler elves aren't real i still have their cookies in my pantry like that feels real to me i have friends that walk with me just like at lunch and my friend like you for a second no you gotta have them all the time you just follow them like you can't leave someone don't let don't uh leave a man behind chowing down on some gribs in the coffee in the cookie version what are gribs it's your first time making a stream. Thank you very much, Sugar X, for stopping by and joining the stream. I hope you have had the chance to submit one of your very own conspiracy, th conspiracy thesis, conspiracy theories. Accidentally put saliva in your eye, Sophie. Look, I am right there with you. I um, I was taking out a contact last night, and it fell onto my lip, and I I didn't know if that would be like safe. I I almost threw it away right then and there. I was like, mm, I don't know. But then like, I've heard of people like licking other people's eyes and there's, there's no infection afterwards. So I'm guessing it's safe. Keebler elf. That's, that's, that's one. Next is Illum Illuminate. <laughs> Illuminati. Illuminati tier is, we're getting to like deep conspiracy. This is a, uh, bro, what? <laughs> <laughs> so for the Illuminati tier, we're talking like these things could possibly uh, be happening and it would have to be like an organized group behind them. And then for like the final one, shadow government. Those are the tiers and it's, it's already fallen off. So let me just uh, rearrange them over here. Uh, and then we'll just make these guys go away for a little bit shh, 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 shh. which is fine and then chat code so these are did not mean to be did, did not mean to move myself these are the tiers i'll be ranking the uh different conspiracy theories in Lupina, hi, how's it going? Let's see these wings behind my back. Oh, Sophie, you got wings. Congratulations. Those are really hard to get. But, uh, you know, if you help someone out, especially on Christmas Eve, it, it gets a little bit easier. It probably doesn't. Uh, my memory is bad. Wait, my memory is bad on what? It remembers me from the amount of times I joined streams and comments on the videos. No, it's no, I remember you definitely from the last stream that we had on Monday. And I have seen you commenting not only on my videos, but you also drop around to, uh, you know, Nayland. And they have recognized your name on the comments as well. A very kind supporter. Thank you very much. Tried to win with their boyfriend last time and got in a fight with her boyfriend. Oh, that sucks. Raisin, raisin oatmeal cookies are underrated. Prove me wrong. I dare you, Steph. That is not a conspiracy theory quite the same way. But they are underrated. Um, you need a certain amount of sugar to make raisin oatmeal cookies like viable, but like if they're like those super soft raisin oatmeal cookies, like, mm, oh, they're good. They're very good. They, they are so good. All right. So for our first conspired theory that, wait, that's the chat. Hold on. Pull up the wrong window close that down we got is going on the first conspiracy theory and these are submitted anonymously so if you don't want to attach your name to a conspiracy theory i 100 i 100 understand some things are too dangerous to be known you have a single dollar and my 25 cents when i go shopping daisy you save all you hold on to that money you're going to invest in crypto and you're going to you're going to 4x your returns so this one is humanity used to live on mars and then killed the planet. They came to Earth, erased their memories in hope of a better future, but ended up killing the planet once again. 
it would make sense. Mm, uh, let's see here. On on a ranking of, uh, I'm not gonna. This that doesn't fall as real. It doesn't fall as uh, Illuminati. Um, yeah, what not? No, 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 no. I'll say this is this qualifies as an Illuminati type one. I would be able to watch your streams. They have been during your work hours. So she, that's totally fine. And we always appreciate it when you do drop by. Or if you just watch afterwards. And crypto. is <laughs> The little audio you did way back then. Uh, apparently crypto is still around. You can turn that um, $1.15, $1.25 to a lot of Dogecoin. It's going to go to the moon. Yeah. The Illuminati is yours. Is that the, the Mars theory? All right. Our next one is, I believe werewolves are real. This falls squarely into the Keebler elf category. Now, you can tell me werewolves are not real, but I can get a werewolf mask. There is a lot of werewolf literature. There are clearly agreed upon rules when it comes to werewolves. And that's a lot for something that isn't real, right? Uh, your work has been great. That's good. That's good. Uh, UTC, how is your day? Also, what time is it? No, it's no, it is 1048 and my day is going good so far. You're saving it. Real money is hard, but I was gonna, I'm trying to be nice and go buy you a pretzel, but okay. Yeah, daily you hold on to that money. Werewolves are totally real. Your grandfather is one. Now, if you're not familiar with the English language, you may not pick up on the fact that Lupin is like the, uh, like a lupus or, or something like that is, is often associated with werewolves. So that's why, you know, uh, and I think Lupina, Lupina, ha, right. Would say that, uh, werewolves are real. Werewolves are not real. I'm going to tell you that right now. It does not fall into the real category. You're a werewolf. <laughs> How did my dog open a door when the handle was a circle? Uh, I don't know. It just, it just happens. I've never noticed that I'm aware everyone is just claiming to be a werewolf. Despite your claims, I am going to, this, this, this goes into the Keebler elf category. There are many things to support werewolves you being real. You're probably a werewolf with how hairy you are. Okay. Who told you my secret? Who told you? That I was in fact really a werewolf only when it is a new moon and uh, that's why I don't really howl that much is because no one can see the full moon I don't see the full moon and transform I transform at the new moon I'm a lot like Inuyasha in that sense but um yeah werewolves not real sometimes I feel wild and I thought it might be my inner cat <laughs> Y'all are werewolves, my mosquito tap dancing on a keyboard trying to send something. Exactly. Are werewolves and wolves the same thing? No. Uh, werewolves are humans uh, that change into wolves or shapeshift into wolves at the sight of the full moon. They howl at the moon. They're sometimes violent and their bite can transform other people into werewolves. I believe that is how the lore goes. For our third conspiracy theory, it is we are always, oh, we always keep traveling to different universes because of the Mandela effect and how we always remember things one way, but really it's another. Curious George never had a tail, despite most people remembering Curious George having a tail. Now this, this is interesting. The, um, the Mandela effect, this, this goes into the Keebler elf, Keebler elf territory. Why is no, 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 no. The PFP is a person turned sideways and it's a picture of their bicep and their chest. It is not a butt. Trust me. I, I thought so too, but that hip dip would be too wild. That is your, what you're seeing is a neck, a bicep and a chest. That is, yeah, this is totally fine. It's not yet. I wonder if cannibalism exists in the werewolf species since they may not have be aware someone knows they're a werewolf or not. Uh, Steph, I'm not 100% certain. I do feel like the um, Underworld series probably addressed that. It's okay, uh, Miss Vivian. 
I made the same mistake for a long time. I insisted that it was a butt, but I later did my research. I looked very closely and I, I came to realize it was in fact a man's shoulder. Yeah, feel like a pervert now? No, 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 no. It is a very easy um, mistake to make. So as, as far as the Mandela effect goes, this is one of those things. Oh my, yeah, that's insane. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh my jet, that's insane. Oh my jet. <laughs> Your phone keeps dying. No. So for the Mandela effect, right? Um these are things that like people agree, you know, uh generally that are real, but um when you, when researched, they are not curious George having a tail is uh, I don't, What is it? Because it's it's like Curious George is thought to be a monkey, right? So people remember him having a tail, but he is like a chimp, so he has no tail. Yeah. This is the most entertaining thing I've done the past year. Join a stream and someone's actually enjoyed listening to it. That's great to hear, Steph. I'm glad I'm glad you're enjoying it. So um some of the other ones are the uh Bernstein 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 Bears. Hold on. There is a wiki of the Mandela effect. And then they made like an entire movie around it. Uh, example. Forbes? I don't want Forbes. Just, just give me a website. Good housekeeping. False memory. 82 examples of a, no, 82, 62 examples of Mandela effect. Um, let's see here. Bernstein Bears. We're called Bernstein Bears. Um, Saw Movie Jiggly. Jiggly. <laughs> Here's one. He does not have a tail. Yeah. Are you joking, Aaron? He has a tail, I swear. No, he doesn't have a tail. Not at all. He's, he's a, he's like a chimp. He's brought back from the deal. He's just like one of those ones that would have like a diaper instead. In the Saw movie, Jigsaw actually says, I want to play a game. Many people think that Jigsaw says, let's play a game, or do you want to play a game? But it really, when he comes out, he says, I want to play a game. Okay. Uh, let's see. Um, okay, so Curious George doesn't have a tail. Mickey Mouse does have a tail. That is one of the uh, Mandela effect kind of things right there. People won't remember Mickey Mouse without a tail. He is a mouse. He has a tail. He is always drawn with a tail. At least in, in the olden days. All right. Uh, let's see here. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Would you believe this one? Uh, Kayla, how's it going? Shaggy from Scooby-Doo does not have a protruding Adam's apple. I don't know if like many people are... Um, are uh what is it called uh are, are familiar with scooby-doo and that kind of stuff but like shaggy having like a protruding adam's apple i think it's like almost a meme at this point all right so those are some examples of the mandela effect and and people like just remember them differently apparently daisy is from a different timeline because they just remember all these being different do i like cats no it's no i own oh well I, I have a cat. Uh, I can't say so much that I own him because he's more like a family cat. He's kind of shared around. But uh, yeah, yeah, I, I am a fan of cats. Hello Kitty apparently has a boyfriend and Mickey has a kid. No way that Mickey has a kid. That's, I don't, I don't believe that. If you like Tyler the Creator, comment flower. <laughs> hey rats, how's it going? How is the cat? Uh, he's fine. He he likes to lay around in the sun all day. I don't believe that Mickey Mouse has a kid, though. That doesn't seem right. Oh my god, did I leave my water downstairs? I think it's a small break for that. Alright, so this uh, Mandela effect falls under um, Keebler Elf. 
Like this is Keebler elf level of conspiracy. There's a lot of supporting evidence for it uh, existing. It is not real. It is, it is by its uh, very nature, not real. YouTube shorts have shown you a lot of things, to be honest. You know what I wanted to do? Um, but I found out it is possibly heavily copyrighted. I wanted to have the conspiracy theme music this is playing. So not Scooby <laughs> I wanted to have the conspiracy theme music playing in the background. The, the stuff from TikTok, but it's actually like a song from Blade Runner. So I don't know if I'd get clapped to having it been in the background the entire time. You have one cat, and she's so fat, I want another, but I can barely do it with one. I, I really don't feel like increasing the number of cats changes much, right? This is sus. Like, uh, so it's not sus um, that that's how like it's pronounced in Spanish. I, I think it's just like one of those things where maybe English appropriated a Spanish word. Actually, I don't know. I'm speaking on my butt at that point. My next conspiracy theory, number four. What conspiracy believe conspiracy do you believe is actually real? This one is that UTC is actually a woman with a voice changer pretending to be an ancient old man. Many people think that Elsa from Frozen helped build pyramids. <laughs> I'm not 100% sure on that one. Uh, this one is real. I am, in fact, a, a woman with a voice changer, and I can prove it. This is my true voice. Um, when I turn off the voice changer, this is what I sound like. And, you know, if anyone has been in a Discord call with me, they'll know this is the truth. Uh, it's this is my truth um a lot of uh balancing and eq and stuff like that goes into my audios but this is clearly in the real category so uh thank you for whoever exposed that this is uh, 100 percent me was a robot before he started streaming fr thought i was a robot oh wow 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 Okay, well then, um, I have Stan Brand, so I will go back to my voice changer, and, um, we'll just move on with the stream. So, yeah, yeah. Oh, man, I tell you what, the, this, uh, voice changer is, like, really expensive to get all the background noise in. I can't be laughing when I wake up everyone. <laughs> it's, like, midnight. It's only 11 o'clock for me. I was fooled in the thinking I was a man. I am 100% my male. Um, and when I have this voice changer, I identify as a man. So there you go. <laughs> but not a robot. I do not identify as a robot like Pi Pineapple Head is saying. So this one goes into the real category. So far, we're not uh, in anything like too dangerous as far as uh, conspiracy theories go. I, by the way, got this... Uh, treat box thing in the mail and i'm going to try uh, something from it so i, I have one of these tbh i feel like so betrayed i'm like flabbergasted dude <laughs> you should be this one it says uh black currant and melon it is a jelly simol i'm going to try this out here real quick because i want to try one of these um things on stream oh god it is the gummy oh this is thick this is thick i am officially a woe man besides so you see how you know what women like in audios oh god you're a women flushed face oh this is um oh, oh. okay well that was an intense taste uh, Oh, it's just like you get, your teeth go right through it like butter. So this is how I look when I'm like an audio is Lupino. Lupino. I'll tell you something. Uh, I'll be 100% honest. Uh, what I rely on is female authors. The ones that um, I do all the heavy lifting as far as uh, what their experiences are and how things have been going. 
um, and, and how people react. Like they are the ones that um, really do all the hard work there. Morgan, my day has been great. I hope your day has been good as well. How is it? How is it? It is a handsome woman. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Do I look funny when I chew? I don't know. Everyone is telling your joke. Muy bonita. Muy bonita. I feel bonita. So number five, the conspiracy. UTC having a secret obsession with Skibbity Toilet. This is um real. Let's be honest here. Uh, this is actually a real obsession that I have. Not only because the uh, Skibbity Toilet has taken over the search as far as um, UTC is, because that's upgraded camera. May upgrade way. Yeah, upgraded. <sighs> Titan cameraman is what UTC is in the Skibbity Toilet universe. And somehow that is more popular than me. Never been a fan of gummies. Why don't uh don't understand how people eat them? Do they taste good or are they just really chewy? Uh Steph, the way I think gummies have an appeal is that um they do both. They taste good and they're chewy. And so you get to enjoy that taste even longer. What the Sigma? <laughs> I might have a heart attack with the woman UTC voice. No. Uh, it's taking a little shower and now it's 9.02 at night. That is a long shower. Man, I, I, I've had some long showers in the past. I don't know. Sure. Please make a skibbity toilet ASMR. It would just be what? All, all that's ever said in the skibbity toilet uh, in the show is uh, skibbity toilet yeah, yeah, skibbity toilet, mm, mm, skibbity toilet, yeah, yeah, and then that's, they got like longer things where they're, um, skibbity toilet, boom, yeah, yeah, skibbity toilet, ee, ee, and I think that's like the entirety of the dialogue inside the skibbity toilet. The school night at 4 a.m., you're not missing this, Max Lambert, a true hero. So yeah, we got another conspiracy that was just confirmed to be true. I am secretly obsessed with Skibbity Toilet. I have not watched all the episodes yet. The lore is super heavy. I have to take a lot of time to digest it as I watch it. Which one of you are paying him to say this stuff? <laughs> uh, you know, I go along with the plunger toilet. Oh man, wait, plunger camera. I haven't even heard of that one. Sound like an old man trying to explain skibbity toilet. Rats, you are you correct are on every account. The toilet. This only feeds the conspiracy. It's no longer a conspiracy, it is conspira fact. Please do a skibbity toilet ASMR. I don't think it's possible. Might unsubscribe if we have skibbity toilet audio. Um I did a skibbity toilet was it Roblox stream, but I don't think I'll be doing an audio wrong thing so many things are going on at once oh no all right uh here is another conspiracy number six that there is another universe out there where i am different and stuff like that anything is possible right like infinite universe infinite number of realities uh multiversal theory anything is possible so i'm, I'm definitely down for that i think it is what is it much more likely that uh there is a different galaxy where you are a different person. But like, why not? Right? You know, I, I, I uh, saw in a video recently that it isn't the, um, the infinite expansion anymore that they're, they're saying that the proof is like everything is rushing towards one point. So it's like a contraction. I don't know to believe that or not. But uh, whenever I think about like, infinite possibilities the idea that everything is contracting down to one point seems kind of limiting this is making me think of a dc movie with alternate worlds and stuff you're talking about the flash movie right oh god that was so bad and now that i have i have actually mentioned it in chat i kind of feel like i am uh, justified in seeing it his voice is being majestic <laughs> Thank you very much. Just reminding everyone, make sure to drink water and get sleep. Eat food. You are worth the world. You are amazing and beautiful and deserve to be here. Just be you and you are loved. That is true. 
ate a giant burger and chips, and now there's a party in my tummy. So yummy, yummy. Lupina. <laughs> what is water? Water is that stuff that's like 80% of the world. It's where all the scary stuff hides, if we're going to be honest here. So um, another universe, I'm going to go with real. Another real. Uh, what is a conspiracy that this person believes in? Werewolves and vampires, once again, falling into the Keebler elf category. There's another universe where maybe there's a Skibbity Toilet and UTC collab. I have to, you know what? Maybe I'll reach out to the Skibbity Toilet guy and I'll say uh, there, there should be like a bunch of, um, there should be collaboration between our two channels. A genuine question. Do I have dyslexia? Because you'd be wrong by, uh, you'd be wrong by everything wrong. Not going to lie. Yes, I do have dyslexia when it comes to reading and I just roll with it. Um, I am too confident to question what I read in most cases. So uh, I am confidently wrong in many of the cases. Hello, it's been a while. Have I been? Gwendolyn Castro, I have been great. Thank you for asking. I hope you've been having a good day too. Found your new happy place, Steph. Welcome to the happy place. You are welcome to stay as long as you want. Jesus, my grammar is ugly. What I meant to say is, do you have dyslexia? Because every time you read something, you add stuff or like, you know, yes, still the answer is yes, Daisy, I do. But as far as vampires and werewolves are concerned, not quite real. Keebler elf territory. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. Uh, female father slays. I have a friend, the male mother, and we do... In Roblox is so fun. Are you talking about the um, skibbity toilet level in Roblox? That's that's where I spend all my Roblox time. I haven't logged in in a while. I do that. All right, number nine. Oh, we got a big one here. So this one is shifting realities. It blew up on TikTok in 2020, and ever since, people still do it and attempt. But many others are strong believers that it is fake. It is where the state of relaxation, you shift your consciousness to another reality, your desired reality. You can choose where you go and whether it be a better version of your original current reality or even a TV show or a movie where you want to experience for real. I believe it is real. I've been trying myself for four years now, even though I haven't succeeded yet. I know I will one day. Shifting realities is some Illuminati type stuff. If I'm going to be honest here. And, and this is, this is, even though I firmly believe, have you read these on screen yet? Have I read what on screen? It has been great work. School has been crazy, but I started posting scripts on Reddit and already had two VAs fill your script. Gwendolyn, that's amazing. Good to hear. What if we were all made out of cotton candy? Then I think we would all melt in the rain. But uh, as far as shifting realities goes, that, that falls squarely into the Illuminati. I'm talking about the Illuminati or the dark, the Illuminati, or, you know, it's like, um, it's, it's like funsy pretend stuff. What ASMR videos am I going to be doing next? Sophie, I am going to be doing, um, I think it's like some gaslighty stuff. I, I've been sick most of the week, so I'm going to fit most of my ASMR, my, most of my recording work in tomorrow. But Nayland has some, written a lot of scripts. And I'm just going to pull from two of those. Rain is scary. Rain is not that scary. I'm terrified of the thunder. Yeah. I don't mind if my friends do. I just don't believe it. Are you talking about uh, shifting? Because shifting... Oh, God. <sighs> okay. I'm, I'm going to level with y'all. I do a script. How do I make my, make me see them? You just email them to me at prof, uh, professorutc at gmail.com. Gaslighting y'all again. Exactly. Don't know about y'all, but it was hot as hell and it's nighttime. Ooh, yeah, you gotta, gotta turn up the fan for that one. So, uh, as far as shifting is concerned, I am a firm believer that uh, it is, well, I think if if anyone shifts realities, it is when they have something like a near death experience, right? Like let's say there's like an infinite number of realities out there and you shift from like one to the other 
Like, if you have, like, a close call, but you don't die, and there is a different reality where you did, right? And maybe you shifted from that reality to the new one. But at the same time, eh, it's like Illuminati little stuff. It's, it's like whispers of it might be real. You know, it's not exactly. Might pass out during this email, <laughs> during the stream. <laughs> Sign my email. Yeah. If I ever shifted straight to Ace Attorney to make out with Edgeworth. Oh my God. Edgeworth. How, how can you stand Edgeworth though? Like Edgeworth is not that cool of a dude. Will I ever make another mental health comfort audio? Um, comfort audios don't really like fit with the channel that well. I still do them from time to time. Like, uh, man, there's, there's some of that like have to do with like, you know, when there's like the apology after an argument, it is comforting in that way, but like, not like 100% focused on comfort. It's uh, it's a, it's a tough fit. Who is Edgeworth? <laughs> Who with Edgeworth? Yeah. I was scrolling and I see you live. Hello. Welcome to the stream, Flores. So yeah, our very first Illuminati entry is from Shifting. Let's go to number nine. Transparent is a color. Clear is a color. Invisible is not a color. Google is wrong. I am right. People call me the right machine. I don't see how this is a conspiracy. This just seems like something that Nutter would say. <laughs> um, make a comfort for those who are afraid of the Illuminati. <laughs> that would be uh, that would be a good husband one. Alone has awesome, but fr I hated him at first. But enemies to lovers. Oh, Edgeworth is an enemies to lovers kind of kind of guy. No, he okay. So like, he's a little bit redeemed in the first in the first game, and he gets his own game, right? But even even with everything else, you know, all things uh, considered, I still cannot find myself standing Edgeworth. He's, he's insufferable. I'm sorry. Maybe you like the silver hair. It could it could just be that. All right. As for the conspiracy that uh, clear is real, and I don't think anyone else is saying that one. So that's gonna fall into the whispers of the Illuminati. Do you believe in recantation? Are you talking about reincarnation, Zoshi? Um, in which case, I don't know. It, it's a tough sell. Uh, reincarnation would have to have like a few things going for it. One being that I don't know if anyone here plays Genshin, but if you do, are you excited for R. L. Aquino? Is who is R. L. Aquino? By the way, is that the uh, Fire Archon? Because I know people are waiting for that. I stopped playing Genshin for a little bit to focus on other games. I've been playing Hades a lot. That and uh, the new God of War. Try not to laugh because I don't want to get yelled at for staying up. She, shh, 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 Nova, don't laugh too much. Don't laugh. Ar Arquilina. Is that the name of the person? Um, there's this guy from, what is it called? Honkai Star Rail that looks like he stole my style. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of peeved, but also like, I'm also hoping someone makes a, uh, a, a live 2d avatar of him. And then I can kind of steal that. The music love for story is literally me with Matthew. Ooh, Rin the rebel. Hello. No, you like a hug. Here it comes. There you go. Gallagher. Oh gosh, they are coming for me. Is is Gallagher who, who are you talking about? Are you talking about the guy that uh is is that the guy that has like a little bit of a beard but like can't grow it like a champ? Like look at this. This is this is full on beard. He's man is a Batista. I don't know what that is. Is it like barista? Starts so crying like me, Sophie, don't cry. <laughs> don't cry. 
All right. Uh, so conspiracy that clear, transparent is a color, not a color. I'm sorry. Uh, there is a color spectrum. There is um, like a spectrum of light. Clear is not on there. So that is Illuminati type stuff. What conspiracy theory do you believe is real? I don't know was answer number 10. <laughs> what conspiracy theory do I think is real? Number 11 is, do you think children are taking over Roblox? That is a real conspiracy theory because it's not a conspiracy theory. Roblox was made for kids. I don't know what you mean. Do I think children are taking over Roblox? I think the average age of the Roblox user base is 10 years old. So you, you can't convince me otherwise. You love Gallagher? You just really love... Hold on a second here. Let me, let me look up a picture of this dude. Hong Kai Star Rail. Gallagher. Images. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know who sent me this? Um, Naylan has sent me a picture of this guy. And I'm telling you, me and him, same aesthetic, pretty much. We're, we're like the same guy. So, uh, you know, if, if, if someone like makes one of his, makes him as a model, I would take that. I'm 21 and I play Roblox. I'm just saying, I think like it appeals to people that can, um, I don't know, like, uh, just swipe at the screen. I, I, I've seen my niece play Roblox and she was five when she started. You gotta be 13 plus to play Roblox. I think that it's a suggestion. I wonder if Gallagher is UTC in another universe. Yes. Me in another universe being the Honkai Star Rail universe is Gallagher. We both share the same birthday on February 29th. So we are both 13. My friends started to watch you for the first time. They asked me if how you were allergic to wholesome now titles. You're more like your canon boyfriend, Sans. Oh, Sans. He is so sweet. Uh, I don't know if he's my canon boyfriend. Uh, am I allergic to wholesome titles? No, Ren. I have plenty of wholesome titles. You just never see those videos because they don't get picked up. Uh, there is a certain structure that uh, YouTube does like, or at least people respond to, and those are the ones that get pushed out. Ketchup. <laughs> All right. Number 12. Not a conspiracy, but history. When I was a child, I saw a video about Illuminati, and I was very scared. I spent more than a year sleeping with my mother, and I became very paranoid. After all, it makes perfect sense for the Illuminati to go after me, since I, uh, as a middle-class Brazilian child, sorry for the mistakes, I wrote this with a translator. Keebler Elf. This is Keebler Elf territory. Because, um, the, the, okay. So like the person very much did see a video about the, the, uh, <laughs> this is you right here. <laughs> so you did see a video. I can't take that away from you. That is something that did happen. Um, the existence of the Illuminati then trying to find you is not something that, uh, is likely, but there is a lot of supporting evidence. So it falls into the Keebler Alp territory. That's just me. <laughs> you have been summoned Bloody Mary. How is it going? Uh, did we say your name three times? Is that how that works? Yeah. All right. So that is, that was number 12 and that is Keebler Alp territory. Uh, conspiracy theory you believe is real. One word, Illuminati. That falls into the Illuminati category. Dual category. Not only does it uh, qualify as the real thing, because I'm sure like there's no way there can't be a group of people named Illuminati. But uh, yeah, Project Blue Beam. Oh, that sounds like one of those like government works that people were saying was a conspiracy theory. But then later like, it gets declassified through the Freedom of Information Act. <sighs> A little bit a little worried to look that one up, but if it's submitted, 
probably will. Care for you to explain? I am a little bit worried there. When people would say anything to frame Beyonce for being in the Illuminati, I don't know if Beyonce is in the Illuminati. But they, it's a much more exclusive group if she is. Not exactly a conspiracy I believe in. This is number 14. Growing up, I went to my grandma's house. Nobody was allowed to talk during dinner. Not because of manners or cultural reasons, but because she believed that there was a spirit living in the dining room who would listen in on our personal business. Yeah, but my grandmother's defense, her house was built in 1809, three years before the war of 1812 started, so soldiers most likely lived and or died there and are now haunting it. Still bizarre. This is Susie, by the way. Susie, yes, it is yours. This falls into the uh, Illum... Keebler mm. Alps here. This is Keeler. And, and here's the reason why. Ghosts, not real. It would be nice if they were. They're not. Uh, but there is a lot of supporting evidence around ghosts, right? And the fact that uh, your grandmother thought that ghosts were like listening in on family conversation. Ghosts are not real. I'm, I am sorry, Daisy. They are not. I have prayed them away, but they, they are just not real. A theory where the government is going, wow, and they use holograms for a fake alien invasion. And then the government will save us to pretend to be a hero. Bloody Mary. I, okay, hold on a second here. <laughs> just, just from an American-centric point of view, right? Um... <laughs> Project Bubble Beam or Blue Beam or anything like that doesn't have to happen. There is already a, a high amount of hero worship when it comes to the military. So that being the um, violent outward arm of the government uh, would not need a fake alien invasion to conquer. They have already spent millions and millions of dollars, um, you know, perhaps billions of dollars, making it so that people hold the military members in high regard. So they're, they don't think they'd actually have to, you know, murk a bunch of people or run ops on them and then fake an alien invasion for that. The Illuminati is really, yes, the Illuminati is real. There is no way, there isn't like 20 different groups that don't call themselves the Illuminati. Don't be scared, it's just a theory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not, no, I don't think anyone would be scared of that. Like, it, there's, it is a theory in the same way that, like, you know, uh, what is it? Uh, uh, God, what is it? Like, steel beams don't melt under such, such an uh, temperature. I don't know. <laughs> CC, how's it going? We read yours earlier, actually. Let me go back here a few. Where was it? Was it number 10? Oh God, no. Uh, but, oh, okay, yeah. My secret obsession with Skibbity Toilet. Yes, we did go over that. All right, next one is, I sort of believe this one, but the CIA had a hand in JFK's assassination. This is real. I'm going to rate that as real. 100% real. No, she needed a hug. I was told that my cat was closed inside the... Wait. <coughs> uh, inside the motor, but he broke his leg since then. He's injured. I'm not sure if he's going to be okay. I hope. I do hope your cat is okay. Uh, I'm not kidding. I'm not. I'm on. Wait. Not only am I afraid of ghosts, you're also afraid of owls. We miss Matt Pat. Matt Pat is the man behind game theory. Uh, Daisy, is this your theory? The uh, CIA is behind JFK's assassination. One hundred percent believe it. Imagine if you see me in AFR, AFR, ASMR about you. You are always the um, central figure in the ASMRs, or at least I try to make sure that the listener is the central figure. In that way, that is always about you. Yes, Daisy. Um, and, and this one is like a lot of evidence to back it up because like the CIA was like running tons of ops back in the day, right? And um, 
I, I've, I've heard some of the stuff to back this up. So I'm going to go with the real because I don't give them the sad shadow of the doubt. Like I, I 100% believe that they were, they had a hand in it. Yeah. Can't stay alone like I normally do, even though it's late. Yeah, I understand. Thank you for dropping by though, CC. I already listened to Fallout Boy. Now you're feeling good. Heck yeah. All right, here's one. Uh, that Edgeworth and Wright are making out whenever you turn the screen off or leave the game open. I swear it's real. Pineapple or Pluto, uh, whichever one you want to go by. This is going to go in the shadow government level of um of conspiracy theories this is not conspiracy theory as much as wish fulfillment and as far as that goes it is not real in the slightest my favorite theory i made up was that the government has something to do with the mafia and explain if you'll like your brain is messed up though <laughs> um I would love to hear your mafia government uh, conspiracy theory, mainly because I don't think that'd be possible for the mafia to operate without some kind of governmental involvement, whether it be paying someone to look the other way or like having people in the government themselves. Damn, how did you know it was me? It is real. I saw IT with my own eyes. You may have saw fan art. Um, this is not the same as when you close the game or turn it off that you're able to see Wright and Edgeworth make out. And how do I know it's you? Because you have a bit of an obsession. All right, Fifi, have a good night. All right, next one is me and you. Or me and you. Devil. Not quite a conspiracy theory, so it's not going to get rated. I'm very sorry to hear that. Are you, are you watching on your phone? No, I didn't. You better not have that data phone. No. As someone who grew up with an anarchist family, this is my opinion. No one can defend it over this because I believe I already, oh, I already get ha harassed for my belief enough. And calling out their obsession. <laughs> <laughs> it's real though it is real i have been around pluto long enough to know it is a real obsession all right aliens are watching through the government and ghosts are real <sighs> once again ghosts not real aliens real i don't think they're watching through the governments i just think it's like one of those things where it is uh impossible for aliens not to be real it's 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 one of those deals where like it is so far so much space so many galaxies so many universes out there you can't tell me the aliens aren't real also like let's say there's like a multiverse kind of theory right in which case like a different version of humans would be the aliens Oh, is this one yours? Ghosts are not real. I'm very it's sorry. It's not an obsession, you peanut eater. I swore. <laughs> so the mafia is so bad. Why does the government let it happen? The Clintons are already a crime family, so there's a tie together somehow. So is this like the Clintons themselves as a political figure? Because you could, I could say like there's a good argument that anyone involved in the government is part of organized crime in the sense that they do get to make the rules and then not be bound to them. Aliens are just floating around in America and I won't relate. <laughs> I don't know if aliens have visited us. If they did, uh, more power to them. But there's no way they're not real. Bust out laughing. I got in so much trouble. <laughs> Gibbity Toilet did not brainwash me. So as far as uh, ghosts, uh, ghosts are Keebler elf level, aliens are real level. What does slash say mean? It is, so if you check out the description of the, of the stream, you will find out that it is what makes the text-to-speech voice talk. As you type in chat, you earn points. You can spend those points to um, then use a little text-to-speech bot. That would be our guy over here. Ba -ba -ba. Here's chat code.
And that thing bounces a little bit when it talks. Skibbity toilet, yeah, yeah. Max, no noise. <laughs> Hearing some strange noises from your kitchen? Oh no. Example, we're no strangers to love. Is that a song? I'm not being held hostage. That is not that. I'm going to blink once to tell you that I am not being held hostage. There we go. Conspiracy theory that you believe is real. Number 20, the government moved us from one planet to another. This is actually the second time this has come up. That being the first time uh, from Mars to Earth. So this is, this is actually more prevalent than I thought. This is also shadow government level stuff. And the, here's a reason I, I label shadow government as like the most far out like kind of thing that uh could possibly happen that makes sense why why would it make sense no ghosts are real you banana man who makes asmr <laughs> ghosts are not real i'm sorry so um shadow government like presupposes that there's a group of people that are in control and it's just not the way it happens it's just too Does many. anything ever drop randomly in your room when you literally did nothing to cause it to fall? No, nothing does drop randomly in my room. But if it were, then I like caused it to fall when I set it up there. Just had a coughing fit because your asthma and your heart jumped. Oh no. I don't know what chat is talking about, but it's funny. <laughs> Disney Emily, welcome to the chat. All right, so you that Goober, is... You do realize you blinked twice. You are being held hostage fearful face. I blink a lot. But if I want to say I'm going to... Here, here, I will blink once to prove I am not being held hostage. There you go. What conspiracy theory do you think is real? Vampires technically can't live through the nighttime since light of the moon is just rays from the sun's reflecting from the moon. This, aliens blink a lot. This is Keebler Elf. Lily, hi, how's it going? Loud, crying loud face emoji sob. Uh, I'm staring into your soul, that is right. I am looking directly at you. I have cameras everywhere. That is how I work and how I operate. Um. So, vampires... Lots of evidence support vampires existing, established lore, lots of media. They just don't. Red, uh, Red the Rebel, you have to put it before the say for it to work. If you feel so chill about ghosts, go to a haunted house for one night and I know where to find one. Um, that would presuppose that a house is haunted. Impossible. Checkmate, atheists. <laughs> I am the CIA. Yes, I am a, I am a CIA psyop. Exactly. <laughs> In the corner of your bedroom, uh, rats. That's not possible. There are no corners in this room. I can I, I, uh, I sleep in a round room. Boom. Conspiracy number twenty-two. Boom. There's an ASMRist under your bed. No, do I, do I work for the FBI? Yes. I uh, collect a government check every month. It must be from the FBI. Do I want to know something? I want to know it all, Sophie. I want to know everything. So yes, the answer is yes. What is a conspiracy you really believe in? see do you think I'm going to pass my physics test and my Spanish test? Loudly, I'm... crying, face, sob loudly, crying, face, sob. Well, then I have to uh, say, if you have studied, yes, Spanish 100%, physics test, um, all, all signs point to yes. If I had a magic eight ball, it would tell you yes. Please get out of your room. Never. I'm on the ceiling. Boom. Loopholes. UTC is all. I am a CIA, mafia, janitor, friendly, neighborhood, spooderman. That is true. And this conspiracy theory says I'm actually 99 years old going on to be 100. Also, yes. 
crying face sob. Is that a code? It is a Any corn emote. Fans? It is an emote. Number 23. What conspiracy do you believe is real? I believe three stages of love. I have no idea what that is. I'll look it up. Of live. Three stages of love. Oh, wow. Rosie, hi. How's it going? You two see him under your desk, Karen. I don't see you there, but there's a lot of stuff under my desk, so it could be anything. I got a monitor, a computer, a rug, so many wires, plenty of space for someone to hide in. According to a team of scientists led by a doctor, romantic love can be broken down into three categories, lust, attraction, and attachment. There you go. Three stages of love sounds real to me. So I'm going to put that conspiracy theory as a real one. I can't tag someone. Oh, I don't know how that works. I hate when people tell me that there's someone behind you. Oh, Miss, I'm sorry. Scared of an ASMR artist in the room. Meanwhile, you can see stop screaming. I can hear you. My door is closed. No. Number 24. What conspiracy do you believe is real? Uh, well, I believe the characters you voice will stop gaslighting me when I clearly know they cheated for real for real. Not, not all my characters cheat. I'm hiding in our dirty monitors. That's, none of my monitors are dirty anymore. Thank you very much. I dusted all of them with a rag. It is. Lupina, you have a good day. I love ranting about my random theories so much. Thank you for this stream. It is a pleasure, Bloody Mary. What if I say there's someone in front of me? I, all of you are in front of me. I see the chat box right here in front of me. Knowing that swans can die from heartbreak is sad since they mate for life. Random fact of the day. Oh no. Ooh. Raz, this one is yours? That uh, my characters are gaslighting you? That. I mean, okay. All right. I feel like, I feel like. First of all, this falls into the, the uh, Keebler Elf category. While there is a lot of evidence that my characters might be gaslighting you, um, gaslighting isn't real. There is no such thing as gaslighting. It is victim Buddy terminology. Boy, if you had a stand, what would it be undefined? Gaslighting is not real. It is victim terminology made up by online people to come up with a different way of just accusing people of uh, saying stuff that they don't like. So that is why it is Keebler Elf, because gaslighting doesn't exist. What might stand be? Um, I don't know. I, I've, I've watched a lot of JoJo, right? But um, I like Star Platinum. Is it, is it too much to say I like Star Platinum? Is that too basic? It's like people saying they, they want to be Goku. I draw your characters a lot, but I don't like my art enough right now, so I don't send it. Hashtag BTS. Oh, you should send it. The art I get is great. Anyone that takes time to put like pen or pencil or anything like that to paper is uh, doing God's work because it is bringing imagination to life. And those are always really cool draw my characters a lot though that is super sweet of you pineapple head see so you love jojo i was taken in by the april fool's joke that we were gonna get uh jojo part seven you are the king of gaslighting doesn't exist i'm sorry there's there's um you can you can say it all you want gaslighting doesn't exist I got scared and decided to run to your bedroom. And when I went to unplug my charger, it broke a little. Luckily, it didn't break. Oh, no. All right. Number 25. What conspiracy do you believe is real? We, not be, we might not be living currently in our real bodies. There is a chance that I am just living in a simulation and my real body is at rest in some sort of lab and other people are trapped in their own life-like simulation so everything i am experiencing is not real so utc you are not real 
this is going to get a solid Illuminati. All right. There are um, some things that can support the idea of a um, simulated universe, right? Because in a real universe... Gaslighting is only an enemy, so it's not real. Yeah. <laughs> Gaslighting is how you get to, like the biggest explosions. Yeah. What is the conspiracy? This conspiracy is the simulation theory, right? That um, well, the, most versions of simulation theory are that like everything is being simulated. Where I'm a hologram, you see exactly that I am not exact uh, in, in behind the screen on your phone. I am in fact um, not there at all. I am just a 2D anime man coming to you live through the power of the internet. I saw a Twitch icon as someone's character and I thought I was tripping. Oh, that's interesting. Um, simulation theory. I can gaslight your room, RNUTC. Oh, no, please do not gaslight my room. Simulation theory states that you know, everything is a simulation. That the universe, everything that you experience, even yourself, is a simulation. Uh, this sounds like a version of that theory, but it also gives you agency because it involves you being a real person, like trapped in the Matrix or something like that. Now, the um, proof for such things can be stuff like the Mandela Effect or, oh, Daisy, have a good night. I might fall asleep, but say, say something funny. <laughs> I don't know when exactly I say something funny. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to be so serious right now. Uh, proof of a simulation might also be the fact that in physics, ideally, there should be a way to find infinitely smaller things and infinitely larger things. But as we have discovered with atoms and quarks and quasars and all those little tiny stuff, there is a limit to how small things can get meaning that if something can't get smaller than that and it can't exist in in smaller forms then maybe like that is the limit of a simulation and not so much a limit of uh theoretical physics gaslight is when you fart in a light you have to fart onto a lighter that is that is gaslighting if i pass out during my stream i'm gonna cry but you'll be asleep i gave a snail a break he's working hard <laughs> Not a snail. That's a conspiracy theory in and of, in and of itself. But that, UTC is a hologram. That's why he always says that he is 900 years old. I am ancient. I am beyond time. 900 is but a brief blink of the eye when it comes to me. Blink, blink, blink. 900 years is how long it taught me. It took me to learn to uh, blink properly like a normal human. Gonna cry the next morning. No, don't cry at all. Oh, looks like Sophie's about to start shifting. So the next conspiracy theory. This one is 26. Aaron Yeager did not die and married Mikasa. This has been concerned confirmed by sources of pain and suffering because I hate Jean X Mikasa. I don't think Mikasa ever marries. But um he does like basically simulate I a feel universe. like if you did a Galinger Honkai Star Rail audio you'd basically become the character at that point I might have to look into that yeah um in T Attack on Titan there is a part where Aaron like simulates out the life that he and Mikasa would have lived in the event that like the big turning points in attack on titan didn't happen and there's like a limit to that so he he kind of like simulates that out lets mikasa and him live that life and then has to pull it back and he has to erase all those memories from mikasa mikasa is here laughing at this nonsense that's not true mikasa is here by my side laughing at this nonsense theory and by the way this one is a uh, total shadow government since it's not real at all Related, but when I got back with the ex I talked about, I was in love. I was in love with a cringe live. Wait, it was worth it. Oh, that's good to hear. Isn't that the paths right at the end? Yes, Ash. That's that's what I'm talking about. It's a delusion, so it's like a simulation. Is what I'm saying there. All right, a theory that someone believes in. 
um, old Joseph Joestar from season three is UT. Shut it down. Shut it down. Who knew this? Oh my God. Who knew I was old Joseph Joestar? Bro, if I fall asleep while watching this stream and then wake up the next morning with a documentary playing on, I'm going to explode. Well, you just take autoplay off, Daisy. Just it's it's possible to turn off autoplay. There you go. Although don't, uh, it should take you to another video of mine. So just to try to listen to as many videos and video ads in your sleep as possible when you are enjoying my sleep aids on the channel. So that one is uh, a real, one hundred percent real. I am old Joseph Joestar. Theory conspiracy or maybe real when I was a kid I slept at my grandparents place and saw an old man sitting like a tree next door smile never went back to them till last year I'm not exactly sure that's a conspiracy and we, we might be drifting away from what conspiracies are at this point I can't rate this one because it is a single person a sping, single person cannot conspire cannot create a conspiracy and I'm sorry about that uh, it does sound weird though it is a sign for you to watch JoJo's. Yes, everything is a sign to watch JoJo's. This is your other theory. <laughs> Might have to use my shovel if the character has. Oh my goodness. Daisy knows too much. This one. Bluey was made for parents with bad childhoods. Not for children. Like the cartoon speaks in a way that is too mature to have been produced specifically for children. I like this is this is Keebler Elf, by the way. Um, that is that is the ranking of that conspiracy theory. And let me tell you why it's Keebler Elf. While there is evidence to support it, the fact is that Bluey is made with a team of child psychologists, and this is why it is kind of the way it is. It has a team of writers, but also a team of child psychologists, which are in Australia, and therefore like infinitely kinder than what you'll experience here in America. I don't understand this live. It's supposed to be send conspiracies, but people are just sending facts. True, true. I'm sorry for boring you, Sophie. Hopefully uh, something interesting will come along soon. <laughs> All right, Steph, you have a good night. That was number 29. Number 30. Ooh, wow. This one is long. Bluey has too many adult themes for kids, in your opinion, and you can explain. Um, I don't know. I haven't seen like Bluey in its entirety. Bluey I have... is literally the only cartoon I can watch for hours nonstop and not get bored of. All right. Well, um, Disney Emily, that is that is cool. I haven't seen that much of Bluey, but I did read like a single article about it that when when it was first popping off. And so that's why um, I, I know about the child psychologist that, that that works with them. And also you'll see that in the credits, it's like sponsored by the Australian government as well. Blue Rose, hi, how's it going? So if you have a good night, get some rest. All right, this next one is researchers have investigated belief in AIDS conspiracies. The belief that AIDS was created by the US government to kill certain groups of people and attitudes towards oh wow okay this is uh towards safe safe practices Ooh, trying made to me cry trying to uh keep this um mind or like in in a, in a way that won't like get it dinged by youtube and then it will just have me like private the entire stream <laughs> bluey made you cry oh i hope it was good tears I put it on for my cousin. I find myself being the only one that was watching it while they play outside. <laughs> Almost fell off my bed because everyone in your house might be going crazy. Maybe it's in the water. Reach is showing more strong that African-American males believe this is a conspiracy and less favorable their attitudes towards uh, safety use. I'm going in to turn, sleep. Good night. Less likely they are to use them. I don't know if that's true. Like even even without the threat of um, what is it called a disease, 
like there's still like the anti baby making side that makes it uh more um prevalent like i don't i don't think anyone like argues with the fact that it's good for stopping babies yeah but um i don't know that that might that might go under shadow government this this conspiracy it goes on for a lot more but it's like repeating the same kind of stuff but then they also say that uh they enjoy the streams thank you very much Eugene. Hey, IDK, how's it going? I'm going to bed. Lupina, all right, you have a good night. Number 31. UTC is not afraid of ghosts because ever since he is recorded, in the, what, ever since I recorded in the tight closet about love and make questionable noises, the ghost felt bad and decided not to haunt him. Okay, so apparently because I make questionable noises in a closet while recording ASMR audios, ghosts don't haunt me. That uh, is the reason why I uh, am not afraid of ghosts. Here, let's be honest. This is Keebler Elf. This is, there is evidence to point that it is true. I do make weird noises in a closet. But in the event, and ultimately it is not true because... Ghosts aren't real. Irma Rodriguez, welcome to the stream. Hello, hello, hello. Number 32. I have a theory that every second is past and Wait, untrue you film to your us. Videos in a closet. I film my videos in the closet. I film the audio in the closet because it gives me a nice robust sound. I found lately that I may be able to may be able to achieve that in my office here. I have a lot of soundproofing up. Um I did it last week. I'm going to try it again this week as well. I concern you. <laughs> Probably true. Uh, every second passes untrue to us. Like every econ, we do something we've already done in a future self as well as we'll do is do it as a past self. I Should I go to bed listening to your ASMR or stay? I don't know if if uh, I can understand that one. Bloody Mary, if you're going to bed, I suggest uh, one of the sleep aids I recorded with uh, two hours. Genshin Impact is a uh, nice and cozy audio, and I, I encourage anyone that is sleepy or feels like it is time to go to bed to put that on and enjoy it. It is one of my greatest works in the sleep aid category because it is one of the only works I have in the sleep aid category. And I spent a full fifty dollars on um Genshin Impact pulls on it. So Mom picked me up UTC that. is scaring me. I wanna go home loudly, crying go home. face, sob loudly, crying, face, sob. Alright, you have a good night, Bloody Mary. Not your conspiracy, but my sister's believes that our planet is trapped in a globe like the Simpsons movie. Oh, wow. This is straight Illuminati. This isn't like so crazy. It's shadow government. But this is not like there's any kind of evidence where you would have it be Keebler Elf. This is a shadow government style um, situation. No, 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 I'm sorry, an Illuminati style situation where like it's it's a nice little idea. It's not harmful to anyone. So it's 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 Illuminati level. It's almost made me laugh 40 times so far. That is a lot. All right, conspiracy theory that someone believes is real. UTC is a young man and he covers up being an ancient man to get views and money yes i pretend to be old to get views and money that is 100 percent a thing that works online um it is a well-known fact that people like older people that is then they seek out the wisdom of their elders so to co-op that i pretend to be old i mean this is such a comfort because I have an anxiety attack hearing noises outside. I'm glad to hear that, IDK. That wasn't a theory, but Walt Disney wanted Disneyland 
in a dome like in the Simpson movie so we can control the weather. I, I haven't heard that theory before, but Walt Disney had like a lot of craziness going on. Throwing vintage reverse catfish. I invented reverse catfish. Maybe, maybe it's possible. I'm tired. I'm giggly. Someone saying or typing wiggle makes you giggle. That's pretty cool. Can't believe keep, people keep thinking the earth might be flat. The earth is not flat. That would be Keebler elf level. There's a, actually, no, that would be Illuminati level because there's barely anything supporting it. And there's people that still believe in it. Our assignment is due at 11.59, almost done at 9.57. Irma, that gives you time to look over it and double check things. All right, so that uh, that one that last one was a real. All right, conspiracy theory that we believe is real. Theory Goodbye, is... ancient old man UTC. Give me half of your money when you pass. Rats, I will write you into my will right now. I will say, give it to rats. Give give my money to rats. All of it. All my money. Just give it to the rats. My theory is that I am Master Roshi or and and Grandmaster Ugwe. This is this is also real. Um this is this is so real because I voiced both of them. Um and for the Oceans dub, I voice Grandmaster Roshi. And then for the, uh, uh, you know, the uh, the Chinese dub of Kung Fu Panda, I voiced Master Ugwe. So you've caught me. This is this is under the real category. <laughs> I'm so smart. I know how. Everyone knows too much about me. Yeah, Daisy, are you, are you submitting these? Number 36. Oh my God. Why are so many of these conspiracies about me? Bro, no way. Damn, you are so legendary. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Almost got caught because you giggled. Your heart is pounding. Shh. No giggling. No giggling. UTC keeps doing pregnancy content, not because he has baby fever and wants to be a dad someday, but because his future self is telepathically sending him this like some sort of deja vu everyone gets. The, okay. Illuminati. There is barely any information that supports this. Would I like to be a dad someday? I don't know. It would, it would have to be like a special someone. Yeah, when you when you're like sixty billion years old like I am, it's uh, hard to think about starting a family. But um, yeah, I don't I don't think it's my past and my future self sending my past me, uh, baby fever vibes. Whatever. My cousins are asking me why I'm laughing at my laptop right now. <laughs> Tell them it's the funny anime man. Do you hear that? I'm a vampire. Vampires don't exist. Nope, I am not a vampire. Nice try, though. Trying to get me reveal the, the existence of uh, vampires. Number 37. What conspiracy do you believe is real? I believe that birds, such as pigeons, that walk around the city are spying on people. Little cameras installed them by the government. I get freaked out by them. This is... Keebler Elf. I think there is a good uh, chance that the government is spying on you. I do not think that they would require a pigeon to follow you around, especially when you carry a camera and microphone in your pocket. That's because I am 17... That, wait, wait. I, I, I got that wrong. 173,636 years old. That is true. Would I make a good vampire? I don't know. I don't know if I got the vampire vibes. No wonder I have a phobia of birds. And look, it's a, it's a phobia of ver birds. <laughs> a phobia of birds might be valid, but I'm saying that um, for the government to spy on you, they don't even need like all those cameras and stuff. Um, so that's that's why this one goes in, in the Keebler elf category. Is the government spying on you? 100% yes. Just, and they don't even have to spy on you. 
they what they do is they just let the corporations spy on you and then they buy the information from corporations because that's how we do everything we outsource <laughs> hey guys there's a thing called phobia or verbs phobia phobia of verbs is that what you're saying phobia of birds as well that is the thing oh god we keep getting more submissions if they're more about me uh are you dio this is a for real question like your old dio as old as dio i wouldn't i am not as young as dio that is uh not even a conspiracy that's more of a question <laughs> uh last one hold on a sign here accepting responses boom we're gonna we're gonna end responses we got okay there's actually one more after that uh what conspiracy do you believe is real i believe butterflies are simply here to torture me i want to know just ask butterflies do not exist for the sole purpose of torturing you that is not true it asserts that birds fly around are not real and are used by the government to spy on people. That is actually an earlier conspiracy, also falling into the Keebler Elf ta territory. Because the government does not need birds to spy on you. Your cell phone is enough. Your computer has a camera. Everything around you has cameras. Everything is connected to the internet. That is all they need to spy on you. Which button? I heard you salty child. Hi, how's it going? And thanks for pointing out the arrow. Error. <laughs> English is so ugly right now. It's because it's late. And we have we have uh collectively sourced close to 40 different conspiracies. And they were all nice and pleasant, except for the AIDS one. Let's be honest here. That was uh that was a little rough. UTC is going to get arrested after this for exposing the government. Yes, 100%. Uh, except that by being a crazy anime guy online, I am helping to delegitimize the idea that the government spies on you for everything that you do. Can I say happy birthday, Nova and Ivy? Yes, I can. Happy birthday, Nova and Ivy. Happy, happy birthday. What is the song like they, they sing at Chili's? It's like, happy, happy birthday, happy birthday to you. Take one down, pass it around. <laughs> Mine is UGC being young and scamming us by being an old ancient man for money. I, it's, I, rats, I'll be honest here. I don't know how that one works. I don't know how I get more money by being, by pretending to be old. See you when you get out of jail. Tell us about your experience. I will share all my experiences about what it is like in jail. I will 100%. I will only be in holding, though. They'll never make the charges stick. All right, then that is all of the, uh, since that is all of those. Ba -ba 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 -ba. No more ratings. Bring back our... Uh. Where'd you go? There you go. Brought back the fan art. Adriana, how's it going? Butterfly once flew into my mouth a year ago, and I'm forever afraid of butterflies now. That you is scary. You're being charged for being a cutie pie UDC. <laughs> oh, no. You're going to bail me out with a dollar twenty-five? Heck, yeah. I'm being charged with being a cutie pie. Yes, thank you very much. Skibbity Toilet is controlling me. Yes, I have a toilet on the back of my neck that is piloting me and telling me to do everything that I say. And um, it, is, it is telling me to convert more people to Skibbity Toilet. This is craziness. It is. It is. And it is midnight for me. I would like to thank everyone that came out to this stream i had a lot of fun you guys have a lot of conspiracy a, a concerning amount of conspiracies evolve in evolving involving me uh, the next stream is actually tomorrow night where i will be interviewing nighttime audio actually take a dollar away and sticking with the 25 cents exactly so I will be interviewing Nighttime Audio on stream. It's going to be uh, both of us on stream. Then I will cut it up and throw it up on. Somebody the... should edit UTC as the milkman from That's Not My Neighbor. 
I've never heard of that, but that's not my neighbor. One last hug. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ah, there you go. I'm under your bed. If you hear any noise inside your house, it's me. I must steal your snacks. You're welcome to them, Disney Emily. I'm not too much of a snack person after I got sick. Um, the f f in February. <laughs> And nothing really tastes good anymore. So excited for tomorrow's interview. So am I. So am I. I gotta get his Discord and, and, and get everything set up. But we uh, we are hyped. I should give you a face reveal or something. Salty child. You know what? I reinstalled TikTok today so that when uh, someone sends me those spicy memes, I don't have to solve a little puzzle every time I click on it. And uh, you know, one of the things that came up was Nick's Moon Reads talking about face reveals and how badly they do in the community. And and if we're going to be honest here, I didn't pay like, you know, a thousand dollars to get an anime man to move on screen so that I could show my own face. <laughs> no, I'm, I could never forget about you. Uh, yeah, Nick's. He seems like a he seems like a cool fellow, and and uh, I might try to get him on the. What's uh, your TikTok? I want stream. It. What's the TikTok? Um, I think it's like ASMR RP outtakes. I haven't posted on it forever, and I need to get back on that and making shorts and stuff like that. But with uh, the new podcast, it's going to like it allow me to uh, create content for that side. I'm also thinking about putting um, the outtakes over there. So, yeah, no, um, pull them up on the podcast. I'm going to try. I'm going to try. I'm going to, I'm going to go after all the big names. I'm not going to say like, oh, you're not big enough to do that. No, I'm going to, I'm going to hit up everyone. I'm going to hit up boyfriend audios. I'm going to hit up Nick's everyone that appears on my little like analytics thing over here. I'm going to try. And you know what? I'd rather them tell me no or them ghost me than me never ask at all. All right. So, oh, 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 that's right. I wanted to find out if I'm going to get uh, dinged for no the conspiracy music. No matter what, music. you look like you will always be beautiful and handsome no matter what. Thank you very much. So I want that. Uh, that's not cyberpunk. It is Blade Runner synth wave. That's an official video. All right, so we're we're gonna try this. This is gonna be our outro, and if it if it forces me off the platform for uh, playing it, then we'll know that in fact I I should not have been playing it the entire time. Now it's time for me to share one of my own conspiracy theories as we wind down here. A conspiracy we that I want to share with you. A Zoom as a live <laughs> I'm recording Zoom. No, no, no. It's just a little thing I, I, I put up there. My conspiracy is one they don't want you to know. If you are seeing this video, it is not a mistake. You have been brought here by a confluence of events to show you the truth about the world. Insert Vine Boom. Gotta go back to the very beginning. <laughs> In the year 2024, May 31st, at night, there will be an event. An event unlike any other. A stream unlike any other. It will be the birthday party. Birthday party you do not want to miss. The truth. The truth is out there and the truth will be revealed about how old I am. OMG say 2024 just got a whole lot crazier. PLS, 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 PLS. 
Insert 12 more vine booms. Yes, coming up. May 31st, when we celebrate the birthday of the channel. That is also why I officially celebrate my birthday right here. Yes, I will be front row seat. I will tell you how old, how decrepit I am and how I am claiming social security benefits and Medicare benefits and Medicaid. <laughs> Well, maybe not those benefits, but still, it's just how amazingly old I am. That is, hold on a second here. Let's get, let's get it. Let's <laughs> see, he's coughing. Exactly, let me skip that. if you want. You'd be surprised if I'm like 30. I sound like in my 20s. Thank you very much, salty child. The cough confirmed he is an old man. The truth is out there. And the truth will come to you. They're coming for you. Yes, the government is about to pull ops on you, and YouTube is about to pull ops on this stream if I keep it up for too much longer. So let me just go over here, make sure we got this right. Thank you to everyone that came out. I will see you guys hopefully tomorrow for the podcast stream. You all have all been lovely. I need to take medicine. Yes, I do. I just can't figure out what medicine stops my coughing. How do you moisturize your decade old skin? Why is he he's just 10 years old? 10 years old at that point. Everyone have a good night. Uh, you know what? Yeah, as long as I got YouTube up here. See you, cutie. Bye bye. Uh, cover karaoke. Here we go. 50 karaoke songs. Didn't know he got played. I know it sounds funny, but I just can't wait. Wait, this is supposed to be easy like Sunday morning. I don't, man, all I care about is the chorus. I'm leaving you tomorrow. Seems to me, girl, you don't know I've done all I can. That's how I think the song goes. See, I begged, stole, and I borrowed, yeah, oh, that's why I'm easy, oh, 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 you know what, Easy Like Sunday Morning was not the song I thought I was supposed to sing, it was a closing time, oh, god, no sings. wonder it didn't match Tim up at jamming, all, don't worry. closing time karaoke version. This is, this totally explains why I didn't understand half of the Cake in the break room. Cake in shh, the. Shh, 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 shh. No, it's it's totally fine. It's totally fine. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Let's go. Closing time. Open all the doors and let us into the world. Closing time. Turn out all the lights on every boy and girl. UHM, UTC. Closing time. What did I walk in on? One last call for alcohol. Finish your whiskey or beer. Closing time, you don't have to go home, but you can stay here. Closing time. I know who I want to take me home. I know who I want to take me home. I know who I want to take me home. Time. 
try for you to go out to the places you will be from. He's ready, he's ready. Watch the stream stop Closing and time. This room won't be open till my brothers or sisters come. Gather up your jackets, move it to the exits. I hope you have found a friend. Closing time. Every new beginning comes from some other beginnings. And yeah. Who I want to take me home I know who I want to take me home I know who I want to take me home Take me home It's time for your sleep Go on, you got a ton of stuff ahead of you, disappointed face. find out like three minutes into it that it, the music was too loud. <laughs> Passed out by two guys, 18 times behind. Focus on the assignments, dump the guys. Closing time. Every new beginning comes from some other beginnings. And 